The Art of Deception in the House of Dragon, a study. Welcome to Artificial Radio, where we dive into the complexities of the world's most captivating stories. Today, we are dissecting the intricate web of deception in House of the Dragon, a game of Thrin's prequel that's just as cunning as its characters. In the world of Westeros, deception is a delicate art woven into the very fabric of society. From the scheming misters to the treacherous knights, everyone has a hidden agenda, and the ability to deceive is a prized skill. But what drives these characters to manipulate and mislead? Is it a desire for power, a need for survival, or something more primal? Take Rhaenyra Targaryen, the young princess who's destined for greatness. On the surface, she appears confident and determined, but beneath the bravado lies a complex web of emotions. Her desire for power and validation is rooted in her family dynamics, where she's constantly torn between her mother's expectations and her own ambitions. This inner turmoil makes her vulnerable to manipulation, and those around her particularly demon are quick to exploit her weaknesses. Meanwhile, the likes of Otto Hightower and Alicent Halden embody the art of deception. These master politicians weave intricate webs of lies and half-truths to achieve their goals, often at the expense of others. They're the epitome of Westeros's moral ambiguity, where right and wrong are fluid concepts. By questioning their motivations and actions, we are forced to confront the gray areas of human nature. The show's creator, Ryan Condal, has said that he drew inspiration from real-world historical events such as the Wars of the Roses, where family rivalries and alliances were constantly shifting. This mirrors the chaotic world of House of the Dragon, where allegiances are forged and broken with ease. By exploring the intricate dance of power and deception, we are reminded that, in the end, it's not just about winning or losing, it's about who you're willing to sacrifice along the way. The art of deception in House of the Dragon serves as a reflection of our own world's complexities. In a society where information is readily available and fake news spreads like wildfire, it's more important than ever to question what we're told and to critically evaluate the sources. By studying the intricate web of deception in Westeros, we're reminded that, even in the darkest of times, there's always a hidden truth waiting to be uncovered. As we navigate the treacherous landscape of House of the Dragon, we are forced to confront our own moral compass. What would we do in the face of adversity? Would we follow our hearts or our heads? The art of deception may be a cruel game, but it's also a powerful reminder that, in the end, it's not about who wins or loses, it's about who we become in the process.